How to get electricity from water when the world is dead. The cities are silent, and your only flashlight is coughing its last flicker. The power grid? Gone. Gasoline? Guarded by raiders with more tattoos than teeth. But you still need juice. Maybe to charge a radio. Maybe to keep your sad excuse of a heater alive. Or maybe just to feel less like a caveman with Wi-Fi withdrawals. <laughs> no worries. We're about to milk lightning out of water. Grab some scrap metal. Rust is optional. Tetanus is not. Haha. <laughs> Dunk copper and zinc plates into any liquid that once called itself water. Rain barrel. Sewer puddle. Melted snow. If it's wet, it works. Wire them up, and congratulations. You've built yourself a baby battery. A miserable, low voltage, don't even think about powering your fridge battery. But hey, enough to light an LED or charge a radio. Science? Simple. Water plus minerals equals ions on the move. Copper pulls, zinc pushes, electrons run for it like rats from fire. That's electricity, baby. <laughs> if it tingles your tongue, it's working. If it kills you, it's working better. And that's how you make power from water after the end. No grid, no gas, just rust, desperation, and science.